hopefully you can hear me. We've got a bike running in the background. But uh, I know I missed my Sunday noon-ish time drop, but I'm actually gonna finally get to go do something that I was planning on doing two weeks ago, but that was getting the Springer out for a ride, testing my redneck free lowering job. So shortly after I did it, then we got some more freezing temps and sub-freezing temps and snow and just didn't get a chance. So we're already running. Gonna take it for a spin, see how it does. So uh, when I get back, because I'm not bringing you guys with me, I haven't figured that out, I'm not super inclined. But when I get back, I'll fill you guys in on whether or not what I did to lower it, and if you don't know what I did, go back and watch, uh, if that ruined the ride or not. So fingers crossed that I didn't ruin anything. Hold up. All right, so we're back. All said and done, uh, I mean, not today, but combined with the one ride I did get to do, I've got somewhere between 10 and 20 miles, which isn't, eh, that's nothing, Let, let's be honest. But at least it gave me an opportunity to try out the suspension on a few of our variously custom maintained roads around here. We'll call it that. Uh, but the Springer, it, it's arguable. I think it's a little stiffer now than it was uh, before. But if it is, it's negligible. So all in all, I think I'm gonna leave it alone. I think, it, you know, I'll spend the summer with it as is. If I change my mind, then I'll put them back and I'll let you guys know, hey, don't do this. But at the moment, tentatively, I'd say it was worth it. So if anybody's interested in giving it a whirl, I say, why not? Like I said, it's 10 minutes of your time. See what you think. If you give it a whirl and completely disagree with me, I wanna know, you know, because I've got, like I said, 10 or, 12, 10 or 20 miles on it, and I think it's it's better. Well, no, I wouldn't say better. It's at least the same, maybe a, an RCH worse. So, and with any luck, I'll get to doing some more wrenching on one of the bikes. Uh, once I clear up a little room, I've got a co-worker's bike in here that's not staying, uh, but might be doing some work on it for her. Uh, she's maybe gonna get some paint done on it so we'll be pulling the tens off at some points maybe uh and then the fat boy might not be sticking around i might be punting that one down the road in favor of the springer so i'll be back to one touring one you know one bagger one soft tail and we'll see i just gotta find somebody who's looking for a good deal on a fat boy and so that's all i've got no wrenching no big news but uh just updating you guys on the redneck lowering kit. So as usual, questions, comments, concerns, let me know. Uh, if you would, you know, subscribe if you enjoyed all this. Uh, like or dislike, just let me know you're out there. Till then, we'll catch you all next time. Later.